Covering Democracy 2012 back-to-back -back days, traveling around Florida, bring Mitt Romney to Boca Raton tonight, a private fundraiser for the presumptive GOP presidential nominee now underway. And News Channel 5's Marissa Bag joins us live outside the event with more on his campaign. Marissa. Michael, a VIP event has started here for those who paid more than $10,000, upwards of $25,000 to be here for that event here at the Woodfield Country Club. Now, Mitt Romney is hoping to attract voters and supporters by attacking, Texas, attacking President Obama Louisiana. about the growing U.S. debt. The national deficit now hovers around $14 trillion, if not more, and those on both sides of the table spoke with us today about lowering it and improving the economy. I think what we need is solutions from a businessman's background, where we cut out wasteful spending, where we try to balance the budget, where we um, take a look at the governmental programs that are out there. President Obama has turned this economy around. You can look at it, all the facts and figures, realistic statistics that show where jobs were and our economy was when President Obama took office and where we are today. And Romney did make stops in Tampa, St. Petersburg, Jacksonville, and Coral Gables since yesterday, so just within the last 36 hours, of course, ending here today in Boca Raton, proving once again that Florida is a crucial battleground state for the November election. And also wanted to mention, it was announced today that Romney raised about $40 million in April alone, and it's estimated President Obama raised about $43 million in April. Reporting live in Boca Raton, I'm Marissa Bagg, WPTV News Channel.